Today we're going to talk about range bags and five items that I bring to the range that you probably don't and definitely should. So the first thing on the list is eyes and ears. Hopefully you already have this in your range bag, but do you have extras? Every time I go to the range, my buddies always forget either their eyes or ears. Uh, my, uh, my friend here behind the camera forgets his iPro every single time. I have an iPro case with his name on the side of it. So don't forget your eyes and ears for yourself and bring some for the homies. So the next thing I always keep on me is tools. Every time I go to the range, I bring tools because guns always end up going down. Uh, some of the tools that I keep with me are things like ramrods. Uh, me and my buddies got some bad ammo a while back and I think it was like 12 times that day we had to bang a, a casing out of the chamber. It was horrible. So another thing is this Leatherman. Uh, it's got pliers on it. You can use it as a hammer because it's a heavy little piece of metal. Um, it's got screwdrivers and knives and lots of different tools that you can use to fix malfunctions or to fix your kit. Maybe you've got a strap that's unruly, you gotta cut it off. Um, there's a ton of uses for a Leatherman. It's a multi-tool, right? Uh, other things to bring along is different screwdrivers. Um, if you've got mounts on flashlights or sights, if you're at the range and you're shooting a red dot and the mount is loose um, and you have no way to tighten it up, your day is done, right? If you're trying to sight in the red dot or if, uh, if it gets loose, you're not gonna be hitting anything, right? So bring screwdrivers, uh, bring Allen keys, whatever you need. Uh, another thing, if you're shooting iron sights, uh, these little tools, they're like two, three bucks. Uh, it's a front sight uh, adjustment tool. You might as well have one in your range bag. If you don't use it, someone else at the range will need it. I promise you it's happened at least 10 times over the last couple of years. Um, bring tools, they're, they're important. The next thing on the list, which should have been number one, is medical. So it's not good enough to just carry medical with you. You need to have the training. Um, so go get training, carry the items that you know how to use. Don't rely on someone else to have medical training because this is a huge deal. It's, it's a matter of life and death. And it's so much better to have and not need than to need and not have, especially in this circumstance, guys. The last thing I have on my list is sustainment. And I know that's not an item, it's more of an idea, but uh, there's a lot of items that go into sustainment, right? So sustaining your rifle or your gun, you gotta keep batteries, you gotta keep lubrication on hand, batteries for your red dot, for your uh, flashlight, for whatever else needs batteries, especially your ear pro. I'm always going through batteries in my ear pro, whether I left it on the last time I was at the range or I just run out of batteries while I'm there. Um, you, don't, you wanna be comfortable while, while you're at the range. You're there to train. Make that your main focus, not all these irritations that come about. Uh, you're gonna be outside, right? So bug spray, sunscreen, food, water, those are imperative to keep you going and uh, to keep your range time enjoyable. It's hard enough to get out there and to go shoot on a regular basis if you even get to do that. Uh, make sure the time you have at the range is the most productive and the most enjoyable time you can make it. These are some of the things that I keep in my range bag. If you think I missed anything on the list or if there's an item you always bring to the range, leave it down in the comment section below. Let's make it a place for discussion. My name's Matt. Thank you guys so much for watching.